Computing determinants can be really complicated when you're dealing with 3 by 3 determinants or higher. And so you definitely want to be able to simplify a determinant before computing it. And there are three rules that allow you to do so. Here's the first. With any determinant, you can factor a constant from a row or column. So for example, here, I've got a lot of common factors in each of my rows. Take a look at the last row. I have a common factor of 10. You can pull that right out and put it in front. So when I compute this determinant, Instead, I can compute this simpler determinant and just m multiply the result by 10. And you'll notice I could actually factor more out. I can factor 16 out of the top row, then I'd get 160 times, and, you, and so on and so forth. And you can keep doing that until your determinant becomes nice and simple. The second thing you can do, you can add a multiple of one row to another. And the same goes for columns. So, for example, you probably noticed before that we like to expand along rows or columns with a lot of zeros. Well, you can create more zeros by cleverly adding multiples of one row or column to another. Now here, what I've done is I've multiplied the first column by four and added it to the third column. So this column is now four times C1 plus C3, right? Four times 16 is 64, add that to negative 64 and you get zero. And I did that to the whole column. Now, what's interesting about this uh, row operation, it's a, ca a column operation in this case, is that it doesn't change the value of the determinant. You can always add a multiple of a row to another row, or a multiple of a column to another column, and it doesn't change the value. And the third thing you can do is interchange two rows or two columns. So here, for example, you know, say for some reason I want to have this zero on the left, I can just switch the first two columns. So these two columns have been switched. Whenever you switch two rows or two columns, it changes the sign of the determinant. So the three things you can do to a determinant to simplify it. One is you can factor a constant out of any row or any column. Two, you can add any multiple of one row to another row, and the same goes for columns. And three, you can interchange two columns or two rows. Just remember to change the sign when you do that.